my goodness, there are actual buses right here. That's insane. What? A crazy coffee meat? Buses? There must be some crazy field trip happening. I guess some police officers want to probably are gonna be here to have to enforce you know the laws, but also probably gonna enjoy the the fun that is you know cars and coffee. I don't know what to say. That'd be a that's a nice track. That'd be a good good um picture for a thumbnail. Holy crap. Yeah, like I keep saying numerous times. Be able to fight against the wind. I'm probably going to be getting a microphone to go with this that way. It won't sound trashy as well. Anyways, let's 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 keep going, you guys. Let's see what else we can come across today. So, you guys, a Tesla Model 3 popped up. If you guys haven't seen another one of my previous videos, I actually got a chance to ride in a Tesla Model 3 before. For the type of sedan it is, it's absolutely insane, and I freaking love it. I think maybe that'll probably be like the first, you know, electric car I might get, just because, because it's not only it's not as expensive as the Model S. But, well, excuse me, there you go. It's not expensive as the as the Model S, but it's also not the Model X either. I probably wasn't pointing to it. I can't see because the sun's in my face. But yeah, it's not expensive as like they say the Model X right here, but it's also not as freaking like, back entry and not as show stopping as the Model S. Because I mean, let's be real here. You really don't need need all that that to show up show up a car. All you need is a loud car, and then boom, you're good. Oh boy. Lots and lots of nice beauties right here. This is beautiful, you guys. Also, a lot of people are probably going to, let me do this right here. A lot of people are going to probably comment and say, why didn't you go to VIR yesterday? Why didn't you go to VIR yesterday? One, I was busy, but two, I just, I just, it was too far, man. I, I'm not gonna go that far. Plus, I had to do a lot of things. So maybe next time when I'm not so busy, I will go to a place where I could do go run my car on a track. Plus, I don't want to put the, um, I don't want to put my put my car on a track against some other cars who are either modified and who will probably just keep lapping the crap out of me. I'm not no. Plus, I want to make a video about that. No, can't do it. I'm sorry, can't do it. <laughs> I ain't doing that. Here's, the, here's, another here's that Tesla Model 3 again. Freaking insane and nice looking car. It's so beautiful. You go ahead and get you move out of its way. But yeah, that thing is nice quiet and it's pretty good looking as well let's see what we got here Super FBI. got Audi S4 A nice, nice Volvo been a while since I've seen one of those before a Volvo DL holy crap Fun fact, I actually don't know much about Volvo, so guys, for those of you guys who drive Volvos and actually like them, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys' opinion on them. I really want to know because because I'm because I, I want to get to know more about the um like car like more about some of the less talked about car brands. So you know, like I said before, let me know in the comment section down below and let's see what else we can come across today. Holy, of all things, that is criminy. If this isn't something straight out of the Fast and the Furious Tokyo Drift, I do not know what is. <laughs> this right here is just crazy. 
And I and I thought felt so people who mod their cars would do it gently. Jesus. This is some crap shit out of the Fast and Furious. This is some legit crap out of the Fast and Furious. All he needs now is the vinyl down the side and he'll he'll be good. Play is actually still pretty good. That thing is low, holy crimmy Christ. I can't do that. No, that's can't do that low life. Can't do that. That's ridiculous. Arrive. Oh my goodness gravy. Yes. 570S baby. This right here is a is a dream car of mine. I would love to be able to get one of these. I love McLaren. I love McLaren for everything they ever do. Hold on a second. Yes! There we go. <laughs> beautiful money shot. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. But yeah, you guys. Um, what do you guys opinion on the 570S? I think a lot of you guys are obviously gonna say, say 570S, best car in the year, year. But one thing I like about the 570S is not only the technology that McLaren has been able to establish in the car, it's just the fact that. Yeah, it's, you know, a supercar, but it's such a beautiful supercar. Yeah, you can go with, for, you can go to the obvious brands for Ferrari, Lamborghini, but McLaren, I don't know why. Just McLaren does something, the way how their car is shaped and designed, and the way how they make their doors, it's just so beautiful. I really do like what McLaren does when it comes to their vehicles. Especially even when you modify them, they are beautiful even when modified. You, you, let me say this, it's hard to make one of these things look ugly. It's really, really, really hard. Every time I see one, it's nearly impossible to see one of these things uh, ugly. So yeah, let me know in the comment section down below what you guys say about, about you know, the 570S. Or maybe, just, maybe even McLaren in general. I think this is pretty cool. Anyways, guys. What else can come across today? Things are doing pretty good. I'm really happy about this. So, um, yeah, very good. And then we got a B10 M5, which is, which is pretty insane. And then we got a beautiful M3 with the competition. Woo! With the beautiful B10 uh, M competition wheels, which I absolutely love. I really wish they would make these wheels for like the other generation of cars. Well, yeah, look at that, you guys. We got a freaking V10 M5 and a, and a beautiful M3 right there. Let me know in the comment section down below which one you like to be V10 M5 or M or um, BMW M3 with the responsibilities of everything that goes along with them. Yeah, which one would you rather do drive? V10 M5 or M Line 6 M3? But the M Line 6 M uh, M3 is faster. Yes, that's right. Even though that's a V10, that M Line 6 is freaking fast. Here, here's another Subi, and we got some more BMWs. We got a uh, BMW E92 M3 style, so we got the M M5. 
and then we got a beautiful BMW right here, which I thought at first a long time ago was a ZHB. It's not, it's just a 325i, but it's still a beautiful 325i nonetheless. We got a oh there we go. Let's highlight the video now. Now the video is gonna get a thousand views. Freaking uh, 2017 Nissan GTR. And I don't mean that just to sound like a dick. I literally do mean that because every time a GTR appears somewhere, it doesn't matter if it's just like at a grocery store, cars and coffee. It could be, it could be pulled. It could, you could just be going to a place just to go wash it. There's gonna be like some sort of like 14 year old boy going up being like GTR, GTR. But mind is that, I mean, it's still a good car. That's not what I'm saying. The GTR is not a good car. It, it, I mean, it, I'm not. That's not what I'm saying. I'm not saying the GTR is not a good car. It's a, an amazing car. It can handle a lot, a lot of freaking insane mods when you want to do with it. <laughs> M3, M3. I like it. I like that. Like that beat. Like, like the M. Like the M. And look what, else, look, what, look what else we got, you guys. We got a beautiful M6. Like it. I like it a lot. Hmm? Hello, hello, hello beautiful V10. Hello, beautiful V10. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, I thought he was going to run. I was going to be like, no. No, we're all about to, there's about to be a scene behind the Fast and Furious. No. Oh, What's going on, sir? Nice. Nice, nice ride. Mm -hmm. We got another old, old emergency BMW right there. Now the question is, now the question is, um, you guys, where did that M6 go? <laughs> That's the thing I'm wondering. Where did that M6 go? Oh, there it is. Ask me, shall be Ask me, shall receive. A beautiful M6. With the freaking, with a carbon fiber diffuser, just to give it that nice, good little pizzazz. Beautiful, beautiful quad tail pipes as well, and nice, good, a beautiful carbon fiber spoiler just to finish it off. Love the wheels this guy put on as well. Carbon fiber lip, li carbon fiber lip spoiler as well, just to really give a nice, better pizzazz. Uh, and here we go. We even also have a beautiful Audi that, that just went by me. Audi S4. And, and the best part about the, this M6 is that it's also lowered. But it's not lowered to make it, you know, ridiculous. It's lowered to a nice, good, beautiful perfection T. Also, I love the paint that's on this car. The car, it actually really gives a nice, good... Like, let me say this. The M6 and I believe the last generation M5 were huge boats. Let me say that. I test drive the M5 and the M6. I mean, they're alright, but that's only if, like going in a straight line. Going somewhere else? Mm mm. Want to turn? Nah, ain't gonna happen. <laughs> but anyways, still a, still a beautiful car nonetheless, you guys. Really, really beautiful car. Anyways, you guys, let's see what else we could come across today. I think I think today has been so far pretty pretty good. I, I I believe so. This has been a really good day. And guys, you get to see a track ZL1 1LE. Let's say that say that five times fast. That thing is this thing right here is insane. This thing, I believe, is one of the fastest. In my opinion, one of the fastest Chevys out there even though you have the z06 you have all these other ones well i can't well i can't say that yet i want to see what that new um zr1 that's coming out you know how that performs if it performs better than that track zl1 le 
I'm gonna be blown away by it. That's gonna be insane. Anyways, guys, let's see what else we can come across today.